this place. Today we're going to be comparing the roll-formed high-strength steel bed of the Chevy Silverado to the aluminum bed of this competitor's truck. We're going to drop some blocks into the beds and see how they hold up. Well, let's head over here and grab some safety gear. This is going to be awesome. <laughs> you guys ready? Yeah. Yep. All right, let them drop. That's awesome. We'll drop them. <laughs> so let's see how the bed's held up. Let's start over here with a steel bed of the Silverado. Yeah, a couple dents, dings, a little scratching. I mean, I'd expect more dents. All right, let's check out the aluminum bed of the other truck. Ooh. Wow. Pour it up right there. Look at that. That's a big hole. That's a huge hole. <laughs> Full on crack here. That's a good size puncture. That's a true split. Look at that. Yeah. Listen to that. Oh, and there's a big slash right here. This is broken. I'm surprised that they're trying to put a product out like this, you know, and they're supposed to sell Ford Tough. I think Ford needs to change their motto. It's just completely ruined. You hear aluminum now, you're going to go, ooh, you know? <laughs> Can't trust this. So you might not be hauling landscaping blocks every day, but you throw a toolbox back here, right? Every day. Want to grab that empty toolbox for me? Did you say a toolbox is heavy? No. OK. Let me give you a scenario here where you're loading your truck, let's say. You put your toolbox up here because you're doing something else, then you turn around. That's not good at all. Wow. Look at that. Holy moly. It's pretty bad. That is unbelievable. It's only a two and a half foot fall and it punctured through the bed like no problem. It has failed miserably. I think we got Swiss cheese for a truck here. <laughs> I'm curious to see if that will do the same thing with the Chevy. Well, let's find out. Same spot, same angle, same empty toolbox. Took it way better. The steel held up. I wouldn't even call that a dent. The steel held up again. So what do you think about that? I'm definitely going to want, I guess, a steel bed now, for sure. How would you sum up the performance of this truck today? The Ford didn't do well at all. It, it didn't hold up to two very simple tests. I would never buy a new Ford truck if they were coming with that bed in it. I didn't think the aluminum would fail like it did. Kind of a letdown in my eyes, because I'm a Ford guy. <laughs> Silverado proved that it is the toughest truck here. For strength, I'm going to choose steel every time. Boom. I just got bit by the Chevy bug, I think. <laughs> These trucks are for work. Yeah. And a little tiny bit of work broke the Ford's back today. We could do one more test here. I can drop my keys into the bed of this truck. <laughs> Might go through the hole. <laughs>